喺边之前记得订阅如一 YouTube， 有你哋嘅支持，我哋先至可以走得更远。头先我喺后台同佢哋讲咗同我保持一点五米距离，如果唔系离咗都唔知啊！我话我意思系啊 ，OK this way this way， 哇！好啦，我哋第二个麦先，第二个麦嘅时候咧，原来都同大家介绍一下吓，好啦。O K 啊，大家可以啊。好。頭先我喺後台仲係用緊英文 briefing 噶，突然之間已經識得聽啦。好啦，大家睇啦，誒咁啊，梗係大,大心心更好啦 ，show 埋肌肉添啊！好，呢、這個部分係冇翻譯嘅，大家都唔好睇唔翻譯啦。好啦，我哋繼續。好，呢一啲事情我唔話。Guys on your right hand side please, another side on your right hand side first. O K, keep your little heart, little fingers on your right hand side. Keep looking the right hand side, right hand side. Other side, guys. Keep both hands. Welcome. 嗱 ，Brandon 咧係嚟自澳洲皇家空軍消防隊，亦都喺二零二四年澳洲消防猛男月歷慈善封面當中嘅主角嚟嘅。咁啊，大家留意個月歷嘅話咧，抱住羊駝嗰個咧就係 Brandon 啦。So, hello, Brandon. Say hello to everyone. 大家好。你好，我係 Brandon。哇！犀利犀利犀利！好啦，中間呢一位嚇笑起上嚟啦，都有幾分似學你會型男 ，Randy Cooper 嘅影子嘅 Ricky， 嗱 Ricky 咧都係嚟自呢個布里斯班消防局，亦都係今年慈善月歷封面當中嘅主角嚟嘅。Hi Ricky， 大家好，我係 Ricky。哇！佢唔知邊個教佢㗎，講到幾聲要俾個心出嚟咁樣。OK， 好，跟住落嚟喺我身邊呢度咧，咁啊笑容拍下手手咁樣啦，亦都有幾分荷里活男神奇洛里維斯嘅模樣啊，有嚟自墨爾本消防局嘅 Marco。<笑>大家好 ，No Hi Michael。好，俾歡呼聲我哋三位先，俾掌聲我哋三位先。Yeah, yeah. This is my first time. Yeah. And both, uh, Brandon, uh, and Michael is the first time. Yeah, for me, it's first time as well. What is your first impression of Hong Kong? Just uh, how lovely the people are, and how fresh all the food is. It's just so nice to eat. How are you guys? How do you feel about the food in Hong Kong? What? The food in Hong Kong. What spikes you ever can you handle? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, the food in Hong Kong is amazing. Everything is so fresh, so much flavor. Um, I love it. The spice. I like things nice and spicy, so yeah, more spicy the better. But everything's fresh and very, very tasty. Everything we've eaten. Hello, Ricky. What spicy level can you handle? Not as spicy as this guy, but um, still pretty spicy. A little bit of spice. I'm used to putting things out that high, not eating them. So it's been different, but it's been it's been really good to try some new spice. I'm probably the weakest at all these guys at the spice level. So my spice, a little bit of spice. But all the food's so fresh, so good. Um, yeah, I've been loving it so far. So. And and what do you think about Cantonese? Is it a tough one to learn? Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's when you when they're standing here talking to you about it. That's not too bad. But when when I hear it really, really fast, it's very hard to understand. I need to slow it down so I can kind of pronounce every word. So which one of you can speak the best? Or I reckon you'll be friendly. Yeah, I don't think so. I'll let, I'll let you guys decide that. Yeah, yeah. Just everything, really, to be honest, just really immerse ourselves in. I think we've got a pretty busy trip, but um, we'll try and try whatever we can, wherever we are. So, yeah, just really immerse ourselves in the culture. I think the first thing that we wanted to try, I want to try, was that uh, thousand year old egg. So we had that last night, and it was it was as bad as I thought it was going to be. So it was pretty good. Yeah, yeah, good protein. <laughs> and can you guys guess uh, what it means by something like? Can we? So what was that? Can we guess? Can you guess what it means by something like? I'll let you guys say that one. I thought maybe tasty or tastes nice. I don't know. I'm not sure. Something like. What it means, I don't know. <laughs> it's something good. Yeah, it's the level of less spicy. Ah, less spicy. Okay. How about Mak Yin? Mak Yin. 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 M
Ning Ta. Ong Ning Ta. Yes. Can you try to guess it? What does it mean? Uh, the type of protein or meat? <laughs> yeah, is there some sort of meat? Or... Someone, uh, something friend of like. I like. Oh, oh, I like. Is it century egg? No, no. It's no. a drink. Oh, lemon tea? Oh, yeah, 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 lemon tea. Uh, yeah. Many Hong Kong girls fancy you so much. What types of girls of qualities do you like love like the most? Uh, I like someone that's kind and compassionate, uh, that has a good sense of humour. I love the beach myself and surfing, so if they love the beach and surfing and exercising, getting out in nature, that's definitely a plus. So, but all in all, someone that's kind, down to earth, and um, can have a good time. Yep. Oh, yeah, it's someone uh, we can have a laugh with, um, have a good time, go on adventures, and eat good food. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, pretty much the same thing. Um, yeah, someone who likes to experience things like us coming to Hong Kong, experiencing the food. Someone who wants to yeah, go out <clears throat> excuse me, and yeah, have adventures with me and yeah, absolutely. And kindness and adventures, all that sort of stuff. Very important. So, uh, what do you think about the two ladies, the two guests today? Oh, that's, oh yeah, uh, how tall? Very, very lovely ladies, yeah, very nice. And they helped us with the uh, Cantonese, which was nice. <laughs> yeah. So, how does it feel like being a firefighter and being the model of a calendar and like traveling the world with different charities? I think it just feels really good to help charities and for a good cause. That's what it's all about. So for us, it's, it's bigger than, than what we are. So it's really good just to contribute to such an amazing cause and to help out where we can. Yep. Have you guys ever thought of that before? Like, like for charity and probably... To be honest, I didn't know doing the calendar, being a part of such an amazing organisation would lead us over to Hong Kong and all these, all these amazing places. So it's, it's been pretty um, surreal and I'm just enjoying every moment of it. And how intense is your guys' uh, work on the team to stay in the Yeah, I think um, <clears throat> everyone's a little bit different. Um, I think for us, because the job that we do, we have to stay fit, make sure that we're able to, you know, do and help as best as we can. So if, we, if we're stronger and fitter, then that definitely helps. Um, our stations have gyms on the station, so a lot of the time when we're at work, we can go to the gym. Um, but just outside of the gym, just being active, you know, Ricky does surfing, help people do hiking, just living an active lifestyle, I think, is mainly what we do. Um, so nothing too too special, just a little bit of gym at work and some lifestyle activities that are, are good for the body. So. Yeah, for me, I, I love going to the gym. Um, just love lifting the weight, so yeah, it's a good lifestyle that I chose. And um, just if you get in there every day, at least do something, then I feel like I've done something for, for the body, so it feels good. <laughs> what was the question? Sorry. All the five in Australia are as strong as us. <laughs> some are, some are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So you guys can use oh. the chopsticks there in a very popular way. Is it, oh. is it tough? How did you learn it? Oh, thank you. <laughs> um, I enjoy eating sushi and having that um, Asian culture at home, so I've practiced a little bit in my past. Um, I wouldn't say I'm great at it, but a little bit. <laughs> Yeah, I wouldn't say I'm great either, but I've definitely practiced at home, just going to restaurants and things like that and, and tried to learn, so I tried to teach myself and yeah, I wouldn't say I'm great, but I, I can get by. And, and the Christmas is coming, how do you celebrate? Not really, how do you celebrate Christmas? Um, this year I'm actually working on Christmas Day, so at our station all our families, all our kids will come in and basically like a big family, so not just firefighters with our families coming for Christmas uh, lunch as well. Um, if we have jobs or we get called out we have to leave but um, it's good to have our family in to visit us at the fire stations and sort of celebrate Christmas as a family, my own family but also as a family of the firefighters that I work with as well. So, yeah. uh, for me I'm not working this year so I'll have it off so um, I'll have a rescue dog so normally I'll take him to the beach in the morning that's his little Christmas treat. And then I'll spend the rest of the day with the family. We'll have a really big lunch at home, and then we just um, play some board games and swim in the pool and and um, yeah, relax. Yeah, I'm uh, lucky enough that I don't have to work for Christmas, so I get to again uh, experience it. Great, um, have a day with my family, 
crow shrimp on the barbie. And uh, yeah, so we good. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much.